The United Kingdom e-commerce market is growing exponentially every year, as well as the fashion industry. That is why in this video, we're going to combine them both and show you how you can succeed in running a UK dropshipping business, whether you live in the UK or not, it really doesn't matter. And also how to mix that with the fashion industry and sell the best clothing products to the UK market. We're also going to go over the best UK dropshipping suppliers to find these clothes products and sell them on your store, as well as other dropshipping tips and strategies so quick intro and let's go Welcome back everybody, I'm Liran from AutoDS and as you know in this video you're gonna learn about the best UK dropshipping clothes products that you can sell on your stores as well as some of the best UK suppliers that you can work with to find these products, sell them and make your profit. If you haven't done so yet, do not forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel to always stay updated on all of the latest and all of the hottest topics, tips and strategies that are coming out in the world of dropshipping as well as success stories, case studies, podcasts, live Q&As and so much more. We're all about helping you learn how to start an e-commerce business the right way and this video of course is no exception so if you're wondering about the uk market it is a very very profitable one and there's never a better time to start than now so let's start off by talking about the profitability now according to statista the forecasted fashion e-commerce revenue growth in the united kingdom this year in 2022 is by almost five percent so a five percent growth from last year giving a total number of over 40 3 million e-commerce users in the UK in the apparel or the clothes fashion industry. So not only is the fashion industry growing in the UK market, the UK e-commerce market is also growing. And when you put growth and growth together, you can also take a nice piece of the cake when it comes to the fashion industry in the United Kingdom by simply creating a UK e-commerce store and market your products to the UK audience. And now we're going to also talk about which clothing products you should be selling. So it is a very profitable market. And once again, there is no better time than now to actually start this business, test out the products and see what works for you. We're going to get to that soon. But first, how do we find the best UK dropshipping clothing suppliers? It's great to find products. It's great to do your product research. But after you do that, you're also going to have to look for the best suppliers that you can work with to grab these closed products and sell them on your selling channel. So first of all, what makes a good UK dropshipping supplier? First thing you should be looking out for is, is this supplier dropshipping friendly? Now you can work with suppliers that do not support the dropshipping business model and you will have to find ways to work around those issues. And of course it is possible, but you can also find suppliers who are dropshipping friendly, who do allow you to dropship their products and it'll be at least much easier to start with when you're a beginner in the dropshipping field. The next thing you want to look out for is suppliers that don't have an MOQ. MOQ stands for minimum order quantity. And if we are looking for dropshipping suppliers, the dropshipping business model states that we can sell one product without holding it in our inventory. And once we actually make a sale, we go to our supplier's website, we purchase that one product and ship it to the end customer. But if the supplier wants us to order more than one unit, that means that they have a minimum order quantity and that does not complement the dropshipping business model very much. So of course, we want to look for dropshipping suppliers who don't have a minimum order quantity. Next, you want to look for suppliers that offer excellent customer service. So when you're looking out for these UK suppliers, you want to see what types of methods you have to reach out to them, whether by phone, by email, by chat, try to reach out to them, see how long it takes them to get back to you. And that should give you an initial indication if their customer service is good. The next thing you want to look out for, and this one should go without saying, is that these suppliers actually have warehouses in the United Kingdom. And the reason for that is because when you ship to the United Kingdom, you also want to ship from the United Kingdom, therefore increasing your shipping speeds and delivery times, giving you happy customers who will return to purchase from your store again. Fast shipping times also reduces the amount of returns that we have or order cancellations from, from orders not arriving on time. Every buyer wants to receive their package as fast as possible and domestic shipping is going to help us reach that goal. The last thing you want to look out for when searching for UK drop shipping suppliers is do they have easy shop policies. This means return policies, shipping policies, refund policies, and so forth. So can I open a return after I order a product? How long can I open the return for? Can I open the return for any reason? Will I get a full refund? Do I have to pay for the return shipping? You want to read about all of these policies on the supplier's website and make sure that they offer the best customer service that they can so that you can offer the same for your buyers. By the way, keep in mind that everything that
that I'm going over in this video, you can also read about it in the blog article, which I'll leave a link to right below this video. So now that we know about what we need to look out for when searching for UK dropshipping suppliers, let me show you some of the best UK dropshipping suppliers that you can start working with today. So starting with the first one on our list, we've got AliExpress. Now for many new dropshippers, you probably may have heard about this supplier at one point or another, but you should know that AliExpress also has warehouses in the United Kingdom. So it is not just a big Chinese marketplace with many warehouses in China, but AliExpress came a long way from just being a marketplace in China with Chinese warehouses. So today they have a global reach and they're starting to have warehouses in all kinds of places around the world. And one of those places is none other than the United Kingdom. This means that we can search for products that, that they have stored in UK warehouses and ship them quickly domestically to the UK audience. Let's show you how that's done. A really quick example. So as you see here on their front page, I can see that they already have accessories for Tesla, but that's not what we're here for. So what we're going to do is search for any product. But before that, we're going to change our ship to the United Kingdom. And we'll also want to change our ship from to the United Kingdom to keep it domestic as stated earlier. So here, for example, let's just search for anything like cat bowl and here we can see all of the cat bowls that can ship to the united kingdom but we're also looking for the ship from so right here on the ship from i'm going to click on that and i'll change it to united kingdom now you can see all of the products that can ship from and to the uk meaning i can get quick shipping times right here from aliexpress because these products are not being sourced from china so check that out and that is our number one supplier when it comes to looking for products to sell to the uk audience but of course it doesn't all start and end with AliExpress. This is one of the first suppliers that you should be testing when starting a new dropshipping business. But of course, there are always more and more suppliers to work with. The second one is Amazon UK. Now, while AliExpress is what you call a dropshipping friendly supplier, Amazon may not be so friendly if you start to ship out multiple products every day from your Amazon buyer account. What will happen here is that sooner or later, Amazon may lock your account and you won't be able to access it again. Now, there are ways to work around this like like opening new Amazon accounts under new IP addresses. Now, just like AliExpress, Amazon also has warehouses in the United Kingdom, meaning you can ship your products quickly domestically from and to the UK. They also have a wide selection of products, hundreds of thousands of products that you can resell on your store, and they also ship really, really quickly. So let's see an example of what it looks like on amazon.co.uk, which is their UK warehouse URL. So here I am at Amazon.co UK. You want to change your deliver to and make sure that you have a United Kingdom, a UK zip code right here. So it'll show you all of the products that can ship to the UK. And you also want to change your country. And here on the top right, you can see that I'm shopping on amazon.co.uk and we're looking at the great British pound currency. So here, once again, I can search for whatever I want to look for and ship it from and to the UK. So since we are in the fashion niche, let's just go ahead and search for any product, even though I'll get to the list later on. But let's keep it basic and look for men's t shirts. Now I'll enter any one of these listings. And today is July 11th while I'm recording this video. And as you can see here, we're getting a free delivery by Thursday, July 14th, which is in three days, or we can get even a faster delivery up to tomorrow by using Amazon's Prime service. So this is how fast you can ship your products when dropshipping from into the UK, when using fast shipping providers like Amazon and all of their shipping logistics. And as I mentioned, a customer who buys from your store and gets their product within a couple of days will be really happy about their purchase. Not only is there a high chance that they will return to purchase from your store again, but they can also refer their friends and their family to purchase from you because, hey, they were really happy with your fast delivery service. And this is one of the most important things that we need to look out for when running an e-commerce business. Not only that, but we also want to sell high quality products. Of course, low quality products will have to put up later on with returns and refunds and things like that. But when you start with really fast delivery and you move on to high quality products, you are reducing the amount of returns that you'll have. You're increasing the profitability of your business and you will have more happy and returning customers. So Amazon UK is number two on our list. Number three is CJ Dropshipping UK. So CJ Dropshipping is a huge 
huge dropshipping friendly supplier that can not only help you find products to sell, but they can also help you source your products. They can also help you find better prices for the products that you are selling. And they even offer print on demand services. So they do a lot more than just being a regular dropshipping supplier. They are 100% dropshipping friendly. They are all for dropshippers and they can't wait for you to go ahead and sign up and start selling their products. Now, of course, you don't have to pay these suppliers anything to work with them. There are no monthly subscriptions. There are no contracts that you need to sign. You can simply start selling their products from day one on your dropshipping selling channel, which we will also talk about very soon. Now, CJ Dropshipping also has warehouses in the United Kingdom, and you can create a filtered search by warehouses in the UK and what can ship to the UK, just like the examples I showed you from AliExpress and Amazon, the same can be done on CJ Dropshipping UK. So go ahead and check them out. They have a wide product selection. They offer POD, as I mentioned, and they also provide high quality videos and images to help you create a better listing. With that and more, CJ Dropshipping UK should definitely be on your list for top UK dropshipping suppliers. Number four on our list, we've got Alibaba. Now, Alibaba is a wholesale supplier who is not not only a dropshipping supplier, but also a wholesale distributor, meaning you can also buy inventory and stock from them. Now, Alibaba is the main site. As you know, AliExpress is the sister site to Alibaba. Alibaba is the main site that has most of the dropshipping stores, most of the manufacturers, and those who also passed verifications so that you know that you can trust the suppliers, the sellers that you see on Alibaba. Now, the thing is with Alibaba, they do not have warehouses in the United Kingdom, but if you are thinking about sourcing products, then you can easily find a manufacturer from Alibaba, get a cheap quote to manufacture 100, 1,000, or 10,000 pieces for that clothing product that you want. But my only tip here is don't move to inventory, at least unless until you find a winning product where now you may want to add your own brand to it or you want to add your brand to the packaging or you simply don't want to run out of stock and rely on a third-party supplier stock you want to have your own so only do this after you have vast experience and after you found products that are selling well for you alibaba though is a good choice because you can easily use their services to manufacture a product that is selling well for you and put your brand on it send it to a warehouse in the uk and start fulfilling the orders from there number five on our list is Banggood. UK. Now Banggood also has warehouses in the United Kingdom. They are a super huge dropshipping friendly supplier, meaning you don't have any worries when you start working with them. Their prices are relatively cheap compared to other suppliers. They have warehouses in the UK. They are dropshipping friendly and they also offer cashback promotions and exclusive deals to help you make more profit on your orders. Number six on our list is Printful. Now, Printful does have warehouses in the United Kingdom. They can help you out with your UK dropshipping business. And for those of you who don't know, print on demand means that you can sell products and put a custom print on those products like a coffee mug or a t-shirt where you write something on it or you add some kind of graphic to it. So print on demand means that you are selling products and you're allowing your customers to customize the product however way they see fit or you, the seller, you can customize the product in advance and of course make it unique and sell it on your store after you print it on those products. So you can leave it up to the customer. You can leave it up to you, the seller. And this is what print on demand offers. The only thing with POD at this stage right now is that it does not synchronize with AutoDS. So if you're using AutoDS to automate your dropshipping business, you won't be able to do it with suppliers like Printful. But if POD is your way to go and you want to do it manually, Printful is a great supplier where you can find print on demand products and create a print on demand store in the United Kingdom. Our seventh favorite UK supplier for dropshipping is e eBay UK. Now you can only use eBay UK as a supplier if you're not using eBay as your selling channel. The difference between a supplier and a selling channel is one, this is where I'm getting my products from, so that's the supplier. And two, the selling channel is where I'm actually selling these products on. I can sell it on eBay, Shopify, Wix, WooCommerce, Amazon, and so much more. And the reason that you cannot use eBay UK as the supplier and also as your selling channel is because once you actually make a sell, then you'll have to provide tracking information and you won't be able to use tracking that's already been used in eBay system and the seller who's selling the product to you on eBay already used that tracking number so you won't be able to use that same tracking for your buyer and if you don't provide tracking information on eBay it's only a matter of time before your store gets suspended okay enough talk about UK dropshipping suppliers let's go over some of the best UK fashion products that we can sell on our stores because we're also here to talk about UK clothing or what clothing products we can sell 
to the UK market. Now let's go over this list. The first one that we have are puff sleeve v-neck t-shirts. If that was a little too long, it's no problem at all. You can simply take the text, copy it from our blog article, which once again, I leave a link to right below this video and go to one of the suppliers that we talked about. In this example, I'm going to stick with Amazon and paste that puff sleeve v-neck t-shirts. And as you can see, it is what we're looking at right here. You can see it's got the puffy style. We've got the v-neck and of course it is a t-shirt. So that is the product that we're looking at. It is a micro niche from the general t-shirts niche and this product has been selling pretty well in the uk market of course when you're adding these products to your store you have more than one variation in each listing so you want to be able to tackle all of those variations have all of them inside your product listing and also show a sizing chart this is really important when it comes to fashion when it comes to selling clothes t-shirts and anything that you need to wear on your body from your e-commerce store so you want to have a sizing chart to help the buyer understand and if this shirt is too big for him, if it's going to be a perfect fit for him or for her. And this is especially, especially important when it comes to things like shoes. So one of the things that you have to make sure to have in your listing is what the size of this shirt or this piece of cloth or clothing is. So when you're adding clothing listings to your stores, make sure that the buyer knows what the size of this t-shirt is. Next, you want to make sure that you have the material down. In this example, we're looking at 97% polyester. This is very important for the buyer to know and will also help reduce a large number of returns when they thought they're going to get one type of material, but at the end they got another. So we talked about the colors, the variations, the sizes, and the material. These four things are very important to add to your product listing. Next, we've got wide legged pants. So this is what it looks like. Let's search for that also using the same supplier. And I'm just using this supplier as an example because they have so many products and it's easy to find them. And it's also easy to generate new ideas when using such a huge supplier. It doesn't mean that you should buy or use only them, but it is one of the best options that you have. Here is wide legged pants. And as you can see, it's a little bit baggy. It's not skinny. It's definitely not super skinny it is exactly what we're seeing here and this product has been trending pretty well in the uk market so of course you can add them to your stores really easily and for those of you who don't know the best way to add products to your store let me just take less than a minute and show you how easy it can be done when you're using business automation. So here I am, I launched the AutoDS platform, I added my store, whether it's my Shopify store, my eBay store, my Facebook Marketplace store, my Wix store, or whatever selling channel you wanna use. Then we're gonna click on add products. In this example, we're gonna go with one product. So I'm gonna stick with single product, but it's also really easy to add multiple products, even hundreds or thousands of products within a couple of clicks. But here we're gonna go with, once again, with single product. I'm gonna choose one of my stores. In this case, we're gonna go with eBay UK. And now I wanna add my product URL. So I'm gonna go to one of these listings. Let's take this wide leg pants, take the URL, copy it, head to the AutoDS platform and paste it under add product. Now the system automatically knows that this supplier is Amazon and the region is the United Kingdom, but go over it to make sure that it's correct. Now I'm gonna click on edit now quick. Now what's happening in these few seconds is the system is grabbing all of the products information from Amazon's website and all of the products information has been imported from the supplier's website to the drafts page of my eBay store where here I can optimize it like the title, the tags, the shipping methods, the policies, the automation monitoring, the products description, the variations, images, item specifications, and so forth. Most of the things were done automatically, but I can always add more. I can optimize, I can remove, I can add. I can even take variations from different suppliers and also from different regions and add it to this product page, making a unique product page on my store that no other dropshipper or no other e-commerce store owner has. So this way you can easily differentiate yourself from the competition and create some really tacky and wild product variations, but of course, keeping it relevant to your product. Now, once you're done optimizing the product, you're simply going to click on save and import. And in just a few seconds, it'll move to the product section of your store, meaning now it's live and anyone can go and see and purchase it. And that is how easy it is in just a few seconds to get a great looking product from your supplier's website to your store, whether one variation, all variations or different variations in just 
just a couple of clicks. That is one of the best advice that I can give you when it comes to importing products to your store really quick. But of course, with AutoDS automation, you're going to enjoy more things like price and stock monitoring, automatic orders, a convenient customer support feature, virtual assistant add-ons, price automation settings, and so much more. So if you're here to scale, if you're here to make it to the big numbers, AutoDS dropshipping automation is the way to go. So wide-legged pants is number two on our list. Number three, we've got full zip hoodies. This is another great product trend that's been working really well for the UK audience. And here is what it looks like. Okay, so we've got all of these products right here. This is another great example of a product that is selling well. Of course, use multiple suppliers when looking for full zip hoodies and add a bunch of them to your store so that you can really test out the niche the right way before seeing what's selling well, what's not selling well. And of course, whatever isn't selling well, you can remove it and replace it with other products that are selling well for you while always testing out more niches more categories to learn about new product trends while multiplying your, the success of the current products that are selling for you. This is the way to gradually build your dropshipping business. Number four, we've got yoga pants, and this is trending not only in the UK, and I'm sure that you know what this product is, but the United Kingdom's market is growing when it comes to yoga pants, not just yoga pants, but the fashion industry in particular. But one of the sub niches that we have here our yoga pants, it's working great worldwide. It's working great in the UK. There are many different types of variations, many different types of yoga pants, different materials, different sizes, different designs. So check them out add these products to your store it doesn't mean add one five or ten but you should add at least 20 different product variations from each product that i'm recommending so that you can really test out the market the right way if there is a certain category that's trending but you only try one or two products in that category most chances are you won't be able to make any significant sales and that is not what we are here to do quite the opposite so it's all about testing seeing what works multiplying your success removing the slow movers and adding more products that are similar to those that are working well for you as i already mentioned while always testing out the market for more. So you want to always have room for both. Number five, long sleeve dress shirts. Now, yes, we are in the summer right now, but the summer is not hot everywhere. And even when we're in the summer, we find ourselves many times at special occasions or highly air conditioned rooms, highly air conditioned areas where a short sleeve shirt is simply not going to work for us during the summer. And long sleeve dress shirts are making an impact in the UK market right now. So be sure to also add them to your stores. And that pretty much sums up the best UK dropshipping clothes suppliers and the best UK dropshipping clothes products. Of course, there are more suppliers that you can work with. There are much more clothes products that are trending well right now, but we just gave you a small glimpse so that you can start and form a good base and shoot forward from here. Do not forget that without dropshipping automation, you will not be able to scale your businesses correctly, especially if you want to be able to sell lots of products on your store. Don't forget to keep learning and stay up to date on all of the best dropshipping tips and strategies, case studies, product finding strategies, methods, suppliers, marketplaces, and so much more. Our blog page is updating at least two to three times a week with brand new content, as well as our YouTube channel with two to three new videos every week, constantly, just to help you create a successful dropshipping business from scratch. So no matter where you wanna sell from, where you wanna sell to, and what strategies you wanna learn to implement, we've got that all down for you on our blog page, on our YouTube channel, on our eBooks page, on our dropshipping courses and so many more resources that we have going on it's all about having the right tools and the right knowledge to be able to take the right step forward and succeed in our e-commerce businesses instead of finding ourselves in a downward spiral to failure because we did not learn the right way so don't stop being curious keep learning if you have any questions let me know in the comments below and good luck with your uk dropshipping clothing business